Well, the only thing that I have to say is this. I'm no stranger to adversity. U.S. federal judge Harry Claiborne may have faced adversity in the past, but never like this. A federal grand jury in Reno has handed down an eight-count indictment, charging that the judge tried to extort a $100,000 payoff in return for stalling a decision affecting a federal probe into voter fraud. At the core of the government's case is one-time brothel owner Joe Conforti. Conforti has been hiding out in Rio de Janeiro, avoiding a five-year prison term for tax evasion. The one-time fugitive is now back in Nevada and is the federal government's key witness in the three-year investigation of Judge Claiborne. But the judge came up fighting. I'm right, and I will be proven right. I have faith in myself, I have faith in my lawyers, and I have faith in God. And I win. What's next for Judge Claiborne? Well, in the most recent prosecution of a federal judge in Florida last year, the judge was suspended by a higher court until his acquittal at trial. And it is in court where Harry Claiborne's future will ultimately be decided. Stephanie Lucero, Eyewitness News 8.